So I got a package delivered by the courier today. Um, it actually came from Germany. When I ordered this, I didn't actually realize it was coming from Germany. It was from a website called Knives and Tools. I'm sure it's specified on there that they were actually a German company, but the, the courier fee was free anyway to the UK from Germany. Uh, I, I really enjoy outdoor cooking. Um, something I've enjoyed for a while. We, in the garden, we've got a Weber barbecue, propane barbecue. Uh, I've done a few videos on YouTube now, cooking outdoors, sometimes use a little wood stove, uh, sometimes we do stuff in the jet boil. I really enjoy outdoor cooking, so I wanted to treat myself to a Dutch oven, which is hopefully what is inside this box. A Petromax FT3T, which should be the Dutch oven, I mean like the packaging, Petromax FT3, and this should be the one without legs, so... They, the, the original ones have those little legs on the bottom, which kind of make them uh, easier to stand up. But I think for, if you want to put it in a backpack, if you want to be moving around, A, it's obviously a little bit lighter. It doesn't have the extra metal that the legs take up and it just kind of fits in a bag better. Well, so that's the top of the oven there. And that's the base. Yeah, so here's, here's the, just to double check, I did order the right one. So it's the flat one. So the other ones have like little legs that kind of stick out, maybe three quarters of an inch or an inch or so. So when you're putting that in a backpack, uh, it kind of fits in a bit better. So that's the one I wanted, FT33, uh, FT3T, I should say. This is the one that's kind of suited on the website, I recommends for two to three people. I didn't, I didn't really know which one to go for. I thought the smallest one was probably a bit too small. Because mostly when I go out, the intention is probably to cook, like either for myself or like for myself and my girlfriend and my son. So I think this is, this is probably, yeah, I think this is probably about the right size. I think this is good probably, we could cook things in here that would either be okay for myself or we could probably feed the three of us with it. Um, so I'm really, really happy with that. It was quite a good service. I mean, obviously in no way connected to... I'm sure, I think the, the website's called Knives and Tools. And so I didn't realise they were based out of uh, Europe at the time. Uh, but they're also doing a thing where, <clears throat> I think like delivery was like six pounds or something like that. But if you got the, if you got the order over 50 pounds, which this, the Petromax was com coming to something like, I don't know, it's like 45 pounds basically for the Dutch oven. If you get it over 50 pounds, then delivery's free, which, it, it was so close to being the free postage that if I bought virtually anything, then I would just be basically getting that item for free. So I could either pay postage or I could pay, um, you, you know, just get the, get the order over 50, then get the free delivery. So I ordered this. I've already got one um, more, a knife. Uh, I've got the stainless one, uh, but I wanted to go for this. This this is really cheap. This Mora knife was really, really cheap. It was like six pounds. So this is the Mora Basic 511 a 2020 edition. So this is a this is a carbon steel blade on this one. So the other more I've got with the green handle, I've used it in one or two videos, is stainless. Um, advantages, I guess, of carbon, you can, most people say, um, you can get a sharper edge. The carbon blade, but obviously, it will dull quicker because, um, you know, it's carbon, not stainless. Stainless has a more durable edge. I mean, it's, it's a bit quirky that it's in yellow. It's, you know, it's a bit quick, it's not really sort of, uh, you know, if, if you're worried about like camouflage, if you want everything to be green, it's not that. But I basically got it for free because when I was buying the Petromax, if you get the order over 50. Um, so it'd be interesting to start taking out, uh, be interesting to compare it to the other blade, how carbon steel is versus the uh, stainless one. Uh, so I'm really happy with that. Uh, obviously the packaging. Supposedly on these, these pets, like with, with um, Dutch ovens, they either come pre-sealed or, you know, you want to um, uh, condition them yourself. Th these ones supposedly come pre-done, so I'll probably just leave, I'll probably initially just like, rinse this out and then start cleaning, um, you know, cooking with it. Uh, but eventually we'll probably have to season it uh, sometime down the road if, 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 if and when it needs it. But I'm really looking forward to this anyway. So just a little bit of an unboxing video, a box, a new, a new toy essentially for playing outdoors. I say I love outdoor cooking. Um, I'll probably even use this in the garden. I say we've already got the Weber barbecue, which in the summertime we're using that three, four times a week anyway. If I'm cooking, my girlfriend generally cooks inside the house. 
if I cook, it tends to be outside the house, whether that's on the barbecue, whether that's going into the field and cooking there. I'm more of an outdoor cooker. The girlfriend's more of an, an indoor cooker. Um, but yeah, I'm really happy with that. FT3-T, the legless version of the, um, the Petromac Dutch oven. I think it's about the right size. I mean, it's quite heavy. You definitely would notice that in the bag, but you know, it's cast iron, it is, it is what it is. But you could easily throw that in your bag, regular size rack sack with some ingredients, go out, do some cooking. So I'm really happy with that. Really happy with the uh, Petromac. It's nice they already come seasoned because you, you can just go get from the get go and go out cooking with it. I'm happy that basically got this more and I for free um, because I had to get over 50 pounds for free delivery. Um, yeah, I'm really happy with that. So a little bit of an unboxing video there, guys. Um, if you like it, I'm gonna probably read through the obligatory um, paperwork that comes with it. That's the Petromax one. It looks like there's even, let's open it up actually. It looks like there's even a little recipe guide. Always up there. A recipe. Yeah, Petromax recipe book. So uh, probably have a, a look through this. Dutch ovens are pretty fascinating. There's loads of different ways you can cook with a Dutch oven. You can obviously cook over a flame, you can bury it, you can put, you can just use the lid itself. You can flip the lid over and just put that on some coals and then, you know, fry bacon, eggs, anything like that in there. Really versatile, really uh, different ways of, of utilizing the Dutch oven. So yeah, I probably spent a bit of time looking through the recipes and I cannot wait to get into the field and start using it. And thanks for watching this video. Um, if you have any suggestions of what you would like me to cook inside the Dutch oven, leave them below and I will try my best to do those. Um, uh, thanks for watching this video guys, if you like it, uh, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in a future video.